a mocha mom and I am back with a new hot topic video my child's hair isn't growing what can I do it's real time in the mocha household so please excuse any background noise you might hear but I wanted to come and make this quick video because I get so many questions in my inbox asking if I could recommend a product if I can recommend something to help mothers who feel like their children's hair isn't growing and I've been there myself for many years but what I've learned is that if you want to see longer hair you have to find a way to retain the hair that you already have so if your hair is breaking off from the ends as quickly as it's growing in from the roots then the hair will stay looking the same length year after year um, we know that the hair grows about maybe about a half an inch. It averages about a half an inch of new growth every month. Have realistic expectation of what, you're, what you've retained. If you've only been working toward growing your child's hair for a month or two months, don't expect to see six inches of longer hair in that little bit of time. So I feel like my success with the girls began once I started embracing fuzz and frizz and not feeling like I had to do their style over as often as I used to do it before. And so that meant I would keep their hair braided up for two weeks at a time. So when I went to detangle, I often experienced some breakage no matter how careful I am because the ends of our hair, since our hair is pretty coily, tends to knot up a little bit. And so, you know, sometimes I can tease it apart with a, with a sharp tool and some conditioner and oil and other times I just can't so I end up ripping through it or cutting the little balls off and that's a little bit of length that's lost every time I style their hair but I notice that if I style their hair less often longer period of time goes by before I have to lose that little bit of hair and they retain more hair so my recommendation to you is yes find good moisturizing products products that don't dry the hair out so that the hair is brittle and breaking off because of that but also consider manipulation you lose a lot of hair by just handling your hair if you really want to see length try to handle the hair as, as little as possible also the friction that happens as the hair once it's longer rubs against the clothes you know the ends become damaged sometimes not we don't break them off we have to cut them off because we see damaged frizzy fuzzy split ends so as little damage as you can you know expose your hair to as possible by even maybe styling your child's hair so that it's up and away from clothes you know all these are all things that you can do to retain length so it's not so much that your child's hair isn't growing if your child's hair is healthy their hair is growing retain the length that's already there and as new hair grows in it's, it's gonna be longer so that's what I've learned so just hope that helps somebody not to waste money on products that promise growth when in fact growth is not the issue retention is be blessed